Hello everybody, it's me, and welcome back to another video. Now, in this video, I am going to be showcasing Polargeist. Now, if you don't know, Polargeist is another one of the roulette exclusive things. I have been showcasing quite a lot of roulette exclusive things, I am sorry about that, but I don't... Chaining takes a long time, and yes. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going to be checking out Polargeist, Polargeist and I'm going to be using plus speed plus magic attack. Now, I'm committing a lot into speed here and not a lot into magic attack for reasons you will soon see. Um, we are going to be using secret the hidden trait of this doodle's ice type moves always go first when this doodle is at full health, which means we're always going to have ice priority, which is really good. And we also have our ice pack here, so we're going to be dealing some extra damage with that because ice pack actually uh, boosts your ice type attacks. And here we're going to, we kind of go all in for speed here. And it's kind of luck based what we're doing here. Right here, we got Harmony, Snowball, Hex, and Gem Blast. Now, we're going to go using Gem Blast probably the most. We're going to Gem Blast and hopefully get a plus one. And then with all of our speed and best, we're going to hopefully outspeed everything. Plus, we have some bulkiness here. Pretty decently bulky on the magic defense side. Um, and we got a Snowball for priority for revenge kills and put things to sleep with Harmony. So I'm pretty excited for that. And I'm going to be pairing it with um, the Mothra, where we can just set up Lingering Poison. Do you not have literally anything? I thought I put stuff on you. Just give it whatever. I don't care. <laughs> anyway. Um, we're going to be pairing it with the Mothra to set up Poison Barbs. And then we got uh, some of our st the bulky st or high damage and common stuff we got here. I also brought back the Drake with it from the last video because I kind of wanted to use it again. <laughs> anyway, I'm excited. Hopefully you're excited. Let's hop in the first battle. Alright, and here we go. Into the first battle. Now... This one got some misprints on this team. He's got a, two misprint starters. This is going to be interesting. No toxic types, actually. So we can actually straight up with Mothra. Then we can pretty much hex his entire team down and, and win. So this will be pretty good for Polargeist. Let's so hop straight into this fight. This is going to work out pretty well. Now, I did kind of notice that my microphone is actually kind of quiet during these kind of battles. Like, because the music is really loud. So I... I got... I'm turning up my mic for a little bit. Hi! That's too loud, actually. Let's turn it back down. Back down to 6-9. Yeah, it's worth that. I'll talk a little louder during this part, just because I think it's better. Okay, I'm gonna Venom Bite. I'm gonna die, though, so... Alright, down goes Mothra. That's fine. All we really gotta do now is just swap in Polargeist. He does have Dark Slash, um, but we do live it because of our decent bulk. And we could Harmony straight up. Um... Which, I don't think is a really good idea. My Gem Blast actually is super effective. Let's Gem Blast. Okay, plus one. That's really, really good for us. Ambush, that's fine. Oh. Okay, we really need Gem Blast to hit here. We really need Gem Blast to hit. Come on, you're 90 accuracy. You can do this. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Thank you. Okay. Plus two. <laughs> I would not expect the strategy to work immediately, by the way. I'd recommend trying to kill their poison types first, and this strategy is going to work pretty well. Um, this is actually a strategy I was going to use in... Um... Don't do this to me. No, please don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. Please, please, please kill. Please kill. The plus two with stab, I literally have everything I need to kill this thing. Please. Thank you, Polargeist. Thank you. But yeah, I'd recommend killing all the poison types before you try the strategy and getting rid of the typeless types. Or basic types. Sorry, I'm I'm using Lumen Legacy and other terms. Um, uh oh. Wait a second. Oh, wait, right. <laughs> he's not a light type. I forgot he's not a light type. I thought he was a squid. I thought it was a. Uh, Polypy for some reason. Yeah, but we're plus two. We're gonna We're getting the sweep. We are getting the sweep. Guaranteed. First game too. Dang. Oh, oh poor Volty. Pretty sure our hex kills because it does more damage. It's basically a 120 base power move. And we're plus two. Oof. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Polar guys is really good. Dang. Thorn it. Quick sting. Ah, oh, I'm dead to quick sting, aren't I? I'm dead to quick sting. Ah, oh, we had a really good run, though. We had a good run. 
you going to you yeah, <laughs> Quick sting? Hello? You don't got quick sting? Is that why you waited forever? And I guess we can just hex. I wanna see if hex kills a plus two against a Blossophon. It's going to, but it'd be interesting if Blossophon actually lives. Because Blossophon is pretty tanky, but that's a pretty good game. GG GG. Well that went pretty well. That went very, very well actually. Let's off the next game. What am I looking at? What 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 am I looking at? Oh my god, okay. Um it's gonna be a pretty interesting game. Uh, we gotta get rid of the spear you before we can pop off with our mans right here, but we actually can set up barbs immediately again. Gonna be using Gruffling quite a bit this game. Uh, Draco Throw is gonna be decent. Uh, yeah, I think this game will go pretty well. We just have to have everything to work out. Um, Polar Grass can be able to wall. Actually, can't wall the bunny. Not yet. All right. He has three diamond prestiges. Boom. Oh no, oh no, 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 Okay, um, we don't have any other fighting type moves, or they can't sing effectively. I mean, fairly certain sling killed it, so let's go descend as quickly. And we will headbutt. Hello? There we go! Headbutt! Yeah. Springling powerful, man. Loves that. Spear you. Mm -hmm. Why does that your face color goes so well with Spear you? All right, let's go to Gruffling because it. Can... I forget to show you how well Gruffling checks this stupid Reaper. It's incredible. Look at that. He thinks he can kill me. He, he thinks he can't. You, you can't kill me. And I'm gonna go straight up and air strike. It's not actually my stronger move. Fast food is my is my stronger move. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it's fast food. But I love Grufflin, because it gets removed traps, can recover, and has two stabs, which are pretty good. So, one swirl. That's a really cool sound, actually. I do like the color with this, though. This is pretty cool. Okay, oh, it's also used crayon. Okay, um, food doesn't hit grass types, right? Yeah, it doesn't. So, I'm actually pretty sure it is food and food, but okay, so we're gonna cook this food type of problem. I'm gonna go to sling, I'm gonna disarm. I'm gonna try to get rid of those, uh, used crayons. So the claw swipes. Ah, uh, we are fine, right? Two, three, yeah, we're fine. Four. Yeah, okay, we're good. So I'm gonna disarm immediately here. Now, we might not outspeed it with, without our whatchamacallit, which we might have to switch back to that. Or we just go for Amber Trap Fly. I'm, I'm trying to see. Amber Trap Fly here. And then a doodad might be better, honestly. I think I'm gonna do that. With my springly. So we, might not, we might not have speed here. Which I don't think we're going to. Yeah, we don't, we don't have speed. You know, sometimes you don't even need tactical thinking, you just need dumb luck. <laughs> All right, quick sting is coming out here, and if I didn't outspeed that uh, bun squirrel, I am not outspeeding this thing. So it's a quick strike immediately. He's just in a quick sting and gets over with, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, I gotta get the amber trap flyback, man. As soon as this is over. Anyway, we can go to Polar Geist now. Spear you is still alive, but we can just we could it's just snowball immediately. If this was a oh, spear, you just come straight in. Okay, no fear. Yo, that's neutral. Well, I'm not gonna stand versus this thing. Like, no, no chance. I'm gonna go to Grufflin. Oh, right. Right. Oh, right. Oh, 
right, right. Oh, okay. Pursuit. Yes. I did end up winning the game, just so you guys know. Okay, and here we go into the next battle. Um, this one seems a little more interesting to me because they have Mega Ordles. That's Mega Ordles is a little annoying. They do have a Core Lizard as well, and I don't have much to beat Poison, so it's gonna be a little bit interesting. Um, I can check it with Mold, but I can't. I, I think I'm gonna agitate a lot this game. I think. Um. So, I think I'm going to lead off with uh, Springling. I think it's my best lead. And I need to get rid of that. This is a good example. I need to get rid of that Toxic type. I do like how Monologue completely destroys him. But I have to get rid of that Toxic type before I can set up my Lingering Poison. Or else things are going to be a little messy, you know? Sendalisk comes out. So, I don't want to stay in versus Sendalisk. So, I'm going to go into Mold. Um, the Sendalisk is going to be a little annoying to take down. Um, if it has an item, it won't be. Alright, so we missed, so I could have actually put this arm there, but that's fine. I'm gonna agitate straight up because I wanna get this point I wanna get this uh, status off of this thing so my hex later will do more damage. It won't it's not gonna do that much damage either way. It's okay, so agitating that thing. That's really good because everyone hates my gordles. Um and I'm gonna go to polar guys. And I'm going to I don't think it can hit me besides um Parasitic Seed. I just it has poison, I think. I think it's poison. I did not know that. Okay, uh, let's go for a hex. Is it Incendalist? Yeah, it goes into Incendalist. Okay, so I don't want to stay versus this thing at all. So I'm gonna go back in a mold. I'm gonna play obvious right now. I'm gonna try to play the obvious game until he wants to go for a prediction. Then I can try to take advantage of that. Fiery bite. All right, that's good. Now I could double. Excuse me. That no. No 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 not again. No 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 so I can go into Gruffling. Or I could go into Polar Geist, but I don't really want to take that much damage on it. I'm gonna go into Gruffling. Um, <laughs> why? Why are you burned? Okay, that's fine. I'm assuming he's galvanized, so his attacks become electric. Is that how galvanize works? I don't know what galvanize is, okay. Dude, I'm so good. Alright, and here we go into the next battle. Now, this is one where the this is gonna be very, very powerful here. So I'm gonna set up. Oh my god. Okay, so he reaccepted it. He just wanted to switch out uh, Lizar for my Gordles, I see. Okay, um, Monologue and my Gordles. We can actually win this game pretty easily. We just have to poison immediately. Uh, yeah, so we're gonna lead off with uh, Mothra so we can get our lingering poison up because he has no poison types. Get rid of our lingering poison. So, unless my Gordles is like poison or something. Okay, so Kronos comes in. Kronos has five stars. Um, I don't want to deal with that. So I'm going to go into Grufflin. I'm pretty sure Grufflin can take this attack pretty well. Right? Retribution, actually. Okay. So yeah, that was pretty good. Alright. Does food hit it effectively? No, it doesn't. But I cook fast food anyway. So it's not secret ability. That's good to know. I'm assuming it's shock. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. 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 You are used crowns. You use crowns. That crap used crowns. <laughs> oh no. No 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 Is it used crayons? No, it it used uh I was not paying attention. No 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 sir. Switch out, okay? Switch out, you're not beating my gruffling. I have to click fast food to there you go, to the all day. Tough lays and then super Stop! Please! Okay, um, take the fire type move. Okay, uh, mold. 
What freaking? Can I hit it? <laughs> I'm gone. <laughs> I'm gonna die here. That looks like it had beast type attacks are boosted. Okay, I'm gonna agitate straight up. Unless that's like Electro Bite or something, I don't know. Does Mold have his stuff? Mold, you better have your crap. I'm fairly certain you do, but I'm a check either way. Thank you, Mold. Okay. Why do I spawn juice on it? No! Okay, um. Going to wave shot. Biomotic. Okay, um this is good. This is good. I do actually want one of these. I want a five-star version of one of these. Uh, okay. So my new plan, I was gonna go into polar geist, but I think right now my best option is to go into sling and disarm. Because if I can disarm one of his freaking items, that's gonna be really, really good for me. Mind power, we should take that. Yeah, we take that pretty well. Alright, let's disarm immediately. We're gonna get rid of something. And we're gonna two it chaos something. Mega Wordles. There it is. Mega Wordles. Oof! Ringling powerful man. Alright, run ahead, but. We might actually be able to break Mega Wordles. We can break Mega if he doesn't rest. He disarmed me. I lost my champion spell. That's fine. Because I'm, I'm gonna kill Mega Wordles in exchange for me losing my item. Which, honestly, that's really, really big. So I will take that. That's really, really, really big. Okay, right now we have something agitated, so that's good. I'm gonna try to keep something alive unless it sends in, like... Uh... Subterfer... No, it is Subterverge. Okay, so it's Subterverge. I'm gonna use Subterverge. Okay, uh... Let's go to Mothra, then. Now, since he's SA, and this he's normal ability, we can set up early poison, I think. Icy? He didn't Subter? Okay, well, I can't stay in now. You know, I thought he was gonna play it a little smarter than that, but he didn't. Okay, so right now we need to play around Horbeast. I think we just lose Grufflin, honestly. I don't see many things we can do with Grufflin right now, so I'll just airstrike. I can't do much with him anyway. Fire Sash, that definitely does. That doesn't actually. That does. Okay! Grufflin's alive by 1 HP, so like, we're doing good. Alright, we're gonna fast food. Just for some damage, and we're gonna die either way. Um, how fast is Horror Beast? Um, Doodle World Wikipedia. Uh, Doodle World Fandom, that is, is an outdated wiki. Uh, where's the real Doodle World Wiki? There we go, okay. Horror Beast. No, it's the wrong one. That's not how to spell that word. Okay, um, 85, and Moth, Mothra, Mothra is 85. Ooh, aren't I really fast? I have 16 plus speed, five stars. How much stars does this guy have? Okay. It's gonna be RNG, so let's go for it. I'm gonna literally poison though, because I think that's my better, best option I, can, I got here. Yeah, good. Woof! Okay, that's really good. That's really good for me. So now my poison's up, and now he has nothing that can get rid of it, I don't think. If he does, then that just really sucks. Okay. Let's go to Sling. We're gonna headbutt. It doesn't kill, but let me get to send in the uh, Polar Geist and Gem Blast and kill it. Do I kill with headbutt? I do? Even without my champion's belt, Springling's still very strong. Very happy about that. Okay. Tough Laze. I'm going to disarm in case he got some kind of item up there. And he did. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm dead no matter what though. Yeah, I'm definitely dead. Okay. That's okay. But now I get to go into my full health Polar Geist. Now, would Gem Blast kill? No. I'm gonna Snowball. Okay. Alright, we not, we're not doing too bad here. We're not doing too bad.
Okay. I assume retribution. I ain't risking that. I'm gonna go to Draco Thread. I will wait to use my snowball. Rec Drain life. I did not think that was gonna work. Oh, that worked pretty well in my favor, didn't it? Okay. Um, let's go. I can get Yarn Snare, but I'm just gonna disarm. And he shocks, probably. Okay. Okay, good, good, good. I think we get this late game clean with the uh, Polar Geist. As soon as Dragothite goes down, I think we're good to go. So we're gonna see what happens. I'd love to see a spirit fighting type. Oh, that'd be cool. Oh, that'd be very cool. In, th in this game. Oh! I'm gonna pirouette just to get guaranteed 40 damage. If he has used crayons, I kind of just threw, I think. Does it have used crayons? It does. Okay, um. I don't think it okos me. Beast doesn't hit spirit. And it doesn't hit ice. So, we good on that, that front. Okay, I'm going to click Snowball. He has Fiery Bite. Oof, okay. That Icy Pack might have actually just saved us there. He has one left. And we got Mold Binotic. What the heck? Nullified all other traits. So, I can't... I don't go first with my thing anymore, but I'm pretty sure I have to be this thing anyway. I think I just text him in the game, right? Right? Okay, we are very close. Agitate. Alright, I think anything kills it here, but I don't think it can kill me in time. Because the poison is yeah, the poison's gonna wear him down way too way too fast. I do want a Binotic though. Harmony, I assume. Okay, I'm not hacking. Okay, I swear. Let's crack its gem blast. Well he's dying next turn, I think. All I gotta do is land one move here. I'm gonna click Hex again. Then I assume it's gonna turn into Gem Blast. So I will have used one of all of my moves on Polar Geist. Yeah, yeah, because Harmony was used. Please. Am I telekinetic? Gem Blast. Gem Blast. Am I telekinetic? That's the question. You're taking forever. Oh man. I don't got all day. I have a black screen. Oh, okay. That's very interesting. I'll be here all day. GG's anyways. It was. Now get out. <laughs> okay. I'm joking. I'm joking. I didn't mean to do that. No. Anyway, guys, that's it. definitely been it on this video, guys. Hopefully, you did enjoy. And if you did, leave a like and subscribe down below. It's pretty helpful. Anyway, hope you guys did enjoy. And Luis is going to take over the entire island. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. This is like a really scary thing to end it off on. Oh, my God.